Hello, kids. I'm Kiki. I'm Quacky the Quacky Duckling. Quacky, would you like to go to a super fun place today? Yeah, a fun place. Huh? Wow. <laughs> Magic Cube, go. That is the place, the zoo. Wow. Hurry, let's go. Hey. The world is fun. Let's go explore. Wow, the zoo! I am so happy! What was that just now? So fast! It was like a gust of wind! Too fast! I couldn't see it clearly! Forget it! Let's go look at the animals! Wow, they are so cute! What are they? They are meerkats! Quacky, did you find a different looking meerkat? Let me figure it out! No, it's not right! Not this one! Try again! No, it's not right! That's it! That's right! Huh? Who are you? Why are you in the zoo? I am number elf one! Oh! You are a number elf! Quacky, what do you think the number one looks like? I got it! Pencil! Yes! The number one is not only like a standing meerkat, but also like a long and thin pencil! Let's do a test! Which of the following can be represented by number one? Which of the following can be... No, it's not right! Not this one! Try again! Correct! That's right! A tree and a bunch of flower all can be represented by number one! And one Kiki, right? <laughs> That's right! And one Quacky! Meerkat is dirty! Let's help it take a shower! Good idea! Let's go find some water! Go! Write the number one and collect water! Let's collect some more water! One. A meerkat! Let's give him a bath! One! Yeah! Let's go see some other animals! Wow! What are the big white birds? They are swans! Quacky, did you find a different swan? Where is it? No, it's not right! Not this one! Drop! That's it! That's right! It's number elf two! What does the number two look like? I got it! Duck! Yes! The number two looks like a duck with a long neck! Let's do a test! Which of the following can be represented by number two? No, it's not right! That's right! Two apples and two lollipops can be represented by number two! Lollipop! I love the lollipop! <laughs> Let's go find some food for the swans! Go! Write the number two and collect food! Let's collect some more food! One, two, two swans! Let's see what they want to eat! One, two! Yeah! Let's go see some other animals! Kiki, what are they? They're making bubbles! They are seahorses! I want to learn how to make bubbles like seahorse! Um, I cannot do this! <laughs> no, it's not right! Not this one! No, not this one! That's it! That's right! It's number L3! <laughs> what does the number 3 look like? I got it! Butterfly's wings! Yes! The number 3 not only looks like a seahorse, it's also like butterfly wings! Let's do a test! Which of the following can be represented by 3? No, it's not right! Correct! That's right! 3 bananas and 3 balls can be represented by number 3! 1, 2, 3! Seahorses are all hidden somewhere! Can you help us to find 3 seahorses? Sure! One, two, three! Wow, nice! You found three seahorses! Let's take them home! Write the number three and take them home! Yeah! Let's go see some other animals! They are doves who say cuckoo! Great! You know so many things! Because I'm a smart duck! Did you find a different dove? No, not this one! No, it's not right! 
That's it! That's right! <laughs> That's number L4! What does the number 4 look like? I got it! Like a little red flag! Yes! The number 4 not only looks like a dove spreading the wings, but also looks like a flag! Let's do a test! Which of the following can be represented by number 4? No, it's not right! Not this one! Try again! Correct! That's right! Four dinosaurs and four cars can be represented by number 4! Dinosaur! Let's help the doves take a shower! Sure! Let's go find some water! Go! And collect water! Let's collect some more water! One, two, three, four! Let's help the four doves to take a shower! This is number L5! I guess it is hidden here. Number 5 looks different from other foxes. Where is it? No, it's not. Not this one. Try again. That's it. That's right. What does number 5 look like? I got it. Like a hook. Yes. The number 5 not only looks like a fox with a long tail, it also looks like a hook. Let's do a test. Which of the following can be represented by number 5? No, it's not right. Correct. That's right. Five flowers and five candies can be represented by number five. Wow, candies! I am going to eat them all! If you eat so many candies, you may have stomachache. Alright, then I am not going to eat them. <laughs> Let's help the fox take a shower. Sure! Let's go find some water. Go! Write number five and collect water. Let's collect some more water. One, two, three, four, five. Let's help the five foxes to take a shower. Hello, kids. I'm Kiki. I'm Quacky the Quacking Duckling. Quacky, do you know what day it is today? What day is it? Today is Sheep's birthday. Let's go make a birthday cake for her. Sure. Magic Cube, go. <laughs> The destination is confirmed! Go! Hi. Hi. The world is so interesting! Let's go explore the mystery! <laughs> Here is the cake recipe! Let's see what we need to make the cake! We need a lot of eggs! Quacky, do you know how many eggs we need? Let me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that eight eggs? You can't count them like that. We have to count them in order. How do we count them in order? I will tell you the answer. Let me teach you a pithy formula. Counting one, and meanwhile, crossing that one out. The final count is what we need. What does this mean? For example, we can count them one by one in this order from left to right. We count one, and meanwhile, cross that one out. This way we won't count too many or too few. That's right. Let's count in this direction. Kids, can you count with Quacky? One, two, three, four, five. What was our final count? Five. Yes, we count one and meanwhile cross that one out. Finally, the count came down to five. Quacky is great. Next, let's count what other ingredients we need to make the cake. How many spoons of sugar are needed? We need two spoons of sugar. Count how many lumps of butter are needed. We need four lumps of butter. Count how many bags of flour are needed. We need one bag of flour. And finally, count how many molds we need. We need three molds. Quack quack, we finally finished counting! <laughs> then let's go to the supermarket and buy the ingredients. These are the things we need to buy, so let's start shopping! We need to find all the ingredients for the cake! Found the eggs! We need five eggs! One, two, three, four, five! Tap the check button to confirm after selecting! Found the sugar! We need one bag of sugar! One! Where is the rest of the stuff? 
Where is the rest of the stuff? Found the flower. We need one bag of flour. One. Found the butter. We need four lumps of butter. One, two, three, four. Where is the rest of the stuff? Found the molds. We need three molds. One, two, three. We have everything. Let's go pay for it. Let's put the purchases on one kind, two kind, three kind, four kind, five kinds. You bought five kinds of things. I'll pay, I'll pay. Well, I can't reach. Kids, can you help me take the money? Thank you. Remember to take your receipt. Let's go back and make the cake. Go! Let's look at the recipe. Add the ingredients first and then mix. One bag of low gluten One. flour. Five eggs. One, two, three, four, five. Two spoons of sugar. One, two, four lumps of butter. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Pour into the separate molds. Three molds. One. Two. Three. Put them in the oven and check how long it takes. Delicious! <laughs> Let's go and celebrate the sheep's birthday! Kids, let's sing a birthday song to sheep! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Thank you for celebrating my birthday! You're welcome! Let's eat the cake! Let's have some more snacks! One day, we bought something to make a cake and gave sheep a happy birthday. Quack, 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 quack.